Hey guys, today I decided to show you how I'm calibrating my pH electrode for GBL pH control computer for my aquarium. So basically you need this stand with the Destrolite water, pH 4 water chemical and pH 7 chemical. So when uh, approximately after 30 days your uh, pH control computer will start to beep or flash the screen and it will say that uh, the calibration needs to be taken. This is a quite a normal thing because after 30 days the electrode pH which is uh, inside the aquarium may wear off and it can show you unclear pH uh, measurement. So, the easiest way to get these uh, chemicals is to buy G from GBL Proflora Cal, where are all these ingredients, pH 4, pH 7 and destillate water. Well, I got myself an easier way. I bought this destillate water, so it's cheaper, costs about 50 cents euro, so I recommend for you also. So, let's start this calibration. You pick on your computer the calibration manual, yes, and press OK. First you need to dip the water inside the destillate water, the sensor and the electrode zone. Then you need to put your electrode and the zone sensor into pH 7 buffer solution. So I'm taking this out from the stellite and putting it in this. So uh, we need to do a little bit dip. So let's make a small dip. Okay. So and uh, you need to remember that this uh, solution needs to be approximately uh, around uh, 5 to 10 milliliters. If it's not enough, just add it. Yeah, it's quite easy, you see. So, when you have added the solution, press button OK. Press OK. And you see it will start to measure, it will start to calibrate your sensor. Usually if the pH electrode zone is uh, quite new and fresh and you have made it uh, quite safely for it, the usage, then uh, it will take approximately two minutes maximum around. We'll see. You see the electrode is inside. It needs to be fully inside the water. You see. Yeah. So just leave it alone and it will measure your zone. So it's almost halfway there. So it's almost ready. Well, <coughs> guys, just remember that for this measurement you need uh, this uh, pH 4, pH 7 solution buffer and destillate water. 
and uh, you need to put the both the temperature sensor and the pH electrode zone. It comes separately from your GBL uh, M uh, control set, but uh, it's worth it, believe me, because uh, if you are not so often having time to check up on your aquarium, then uh, this is a quite good solution. And if you have uh, the demanding plants, which I got in my aquarium, then uh, this is a good way to do it and to have this pH control. So, it's almost done. And now, when it's ready, if the measurement will be okay, then it will take me to the next step. So let's see. Yeah, it's okay. So, when it's ready, we need to press the OK button. And now it, will, it says that I need to rinse both sensors in, again, distilled water. Yes. And afterwards, I need to put it in the buffer pH 4.0. Yes. So I'm rinsing. And now I'm putting my sensors in this, in this. You see. So here it is. And press again OK button when it's ready and press OK. For pH 4, it may take a little bit longer, as I remember, because uh, each time when I'm calibrating my sensor, uh, this is the, um, so let me see, this is the, I bought it in August, so August, September, October, November, December, this is the fifth time I'm calibrating my pH electrode, so five months <coughs> have passed. No, this is the sixth one, and uh, yeah, we'll see how it's going, because, uh, oh, actually it's going quite fast, we'll see. If the measurement will be okay, then we will have it done, and uh, so, this is a useful set. So, you can buy it in your local store, these, this measurement kit, because, uh, you know, uh, people nowadays are a little bit lazy and they need some help and, uh, from the stores, so GBL has fought for them. But if you have some friends who like some, who works in chemical field medicine, then uh, you can arrange quite easily these uh, sets because uh, there are some um, simple chemicals used in this and uh, you can buy it much more cheaper. But uh, this set, it's uh, almost in the middle, so I suppose this set will last for you for one year. This set for one year, not bad because the prices are average 5 euros or a bit less so 5 euros for 10, 11 or 12, 12 months it's okay, the price is not so bad so the sensor is still inside and we'll see oh it's beautiful well let's see how it will go if the well, I have maintained my sensor, I have tried to maintain it in quite in well condition. I have put it in the storage solution for some time because my pH control uh, GBL temperature sensor probe was a little broken. It got corrosion, so yeah, it, it got changed, frankly. And uh, let's see. So it's almost done. And if the calibration is OK, then you will see this view and then press OK button. 
and calibration is okay and accept once more so so guys this was the manual for this calibration feel free to ask some questions thanks take care